can do this. Good morning. Welcome to Melbourne Airport. We are going to Hobart today. That's literally all I have to say because I'm too tired and I've got nothing else. It's Claire. Hi. I'm really excited. <laughs> she is excited even though that doesn't sound excited. <laughs> <laughs> it's early and we're both getting used to the camera still, so it'll get better, maybe. Who okay. knows, we'll see. If not, it'll just be scenery shots, it's fine. But welcome to Melbourne Airport. Let's go to Hobart. I wanna get to your clothes, gotta get it right now. I wanna push all the limits with you right now. So watch your feelings, the city screaming when I'm coming home tonight. We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now. People talk and tell what you wanna hear now But they all disappear, they will let you down so We better stick together, let's come whatever We're not coming home tonight We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now Okay, so welcome to Mountfield National Park. Thanks, Claire. And we're going to find some waterfalls. Should take us about three hours, maybe? And the weather is really nice. <laughs> Just a little cold, but it's fine. Apparently, I look really British today with this. <laughs> In the words of the American. It's true. <laughs> British people do this, apparently. <laughs> Have you ever seen a more wrapped up person? <laughs> I know you're jealous. <laughs> Really jealous. <laughs> so we made it to Lady Baron's Pool. Is that right? Yeah, that's really nice. Very pretty. Beautiful. <laughs> uh, and apparently the walk was. I don't know. Well, the, walk, but the whole walk is supposed to be like two and a half hours and we've already been probably walking for about an hour and a bit because I lost my lens cap and then we had to find it for 20 minutes. Claire's so lucky to be on holiday with me. <laughs> I'm very lucky. I was standing outside waiting, waiting for you. You were always taking time, baby. Snow gum track going towards Lake Seal Lookout, and the views are amazing. You were running from it all, you got me waiting. I'm on fire. What is it? What? It's not even a path. Is this where we stop? I don't know. Okay, so we're at, we're at a lookout, and it's very pretty, but there's also these rocks which are tough and hard work. Apparently we're on a trail. Mm. What was the, the gum trip? There's something about gum lookout. Snow gum lookout. We're at snow gum lookout apparently. <laughs> Good morning. We are at the Kettering Ferry Terminal. We're going to Brunny. Brunny? Bruny Island. Bruni. No, I would say Bruny. Bruny. No That's D. my American accent. Bruny <laughs> Island. And we're kind of quite excited because it looks ridiculous. We might just live there instead. We may not come back to Melbourne. We're going on to the ferry. Oh, how exciting. Oh, look, it's a dog. Are you excited? I am very
happy Saturday. We are at Kate's Berry Farm on the way to Frisinet. Frisinet. I wish I could say this stuff. Frisinet National Park. I'm really sorry for anybody from Tasmania watching this. Apparently, I just can't pronounce anything on this island. We found this because we've been following the itinerary of a blog. The blog post is amazing because everywhere we've been so far is beautiful and so good. So we've come to Kate's Berry Farm to have cream tea and cakes and coffee and stuff and it's so beautiful here. Oh this is so cute. So we're going now going to Wineglass Bay which is in Freshnet. Not sure. Freshnet National it. Park. I've already apologised to anybody that's from Tasmania because neither of us managed managed to say any of the names correctly. But no, it's not bad. Average beach. Glass Bay Beach and now we have to go up 800 steps I think to get back to the viewpoint at the top. And it's really lovely down here but we've been putting off going up the steps <laughs> and I'm not looking forward to this. Back through the scary trees. As we climb up these steps I think we should think about two things, pizza and wine. Yeah! May the eyes ever be in your face. How do you feel? I'm really tired. <laughs> Still have a whole nother, I think I like half to like 400 steps or something. Yeah. Night to self, do more cardio. We made it! <laughs> so, yeah! It actually wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Would you agree? retreats. It's ridiculously pretty. There's yurts, toilet, cabins, a fire pit, a communal kitchen. It's so nice. This is a communal kitchen and dining area. Let's go. This is so cute. We're in a yurt. They very kindly made us a yurt actually. I should say that because they made us one up. Not built it just to be clear but they made it all nice for us which is super cute. I don't think I've ever been to a more romantic place. <laughs> Our yurt view outside is it so Left here. 
Welcome to Dove Lake and Cradle Mountain. Can't you see the mountain? Beautiful. <laughs> Life is about the journey, not the destination. <laughs> Happy Monday and the rain has finally hit Tasmania and we no longer have glorious sunshine. We just have rainy, drizzly weather. And unfortunately it's the day we came to see the mountain, <laughs> AKA Cradle Mountain but we're still gonna go on a hike and luckily it stopped raining, so things are looking up. We were close to see the sun, but clouds got in our way. And so this place to be a view behind us. Hmm. No. No view. Hi, welcome to Cradle Mountain. Can you see it? <laughs> Neither can we. <laughs> this is where we're staying tonight. <sighs> Gonna get Claire to do a little demonstration. <laughs> it's like, uh, oh my god, isn't this cool? <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> We are at Launceston Airport and we've made it to the end of our road trip. Had a great time. We're still friends. Yay. We plan to travel together again. <laughs> I just want to say thank you to Claire for putting up with me for like six days. We've had a lot of car time together, so. <laughs> About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking We'll get away To a place where we don't know